Yo, what's going on, sexy sailor? It's quite a day we're here doing a ranked 1v1, and it is Thursday, and I am gonna be, be starting fun. back <laughs> try hard Thursday. So let's get right into it, baby. Try hard Thursday. I'm hyped, I'm ready, I'm Freddy, and I'm still ugly, but hype. Doesn't matter. Soul mirror match to start the day off. Couldn't be any more try hard than this. I'm about it. I'm about it. MMR will pop up shortly. I'm sure. I'm sure. Appa is crying at my feet for some reason. I don't know why. Um, what is my relic of choice? Probably just a shell. And do this. He is 1500 MMR. I am 2275. 1500 MMR means it's his first game. If he's exactly 1500 MMR. Or, or it means that he has his profile hidden. And um, I don't actually know it's what MMR he is. More than ourselves. likely, more than likely, I probably just don't know what his MMR is because his profile is hidden. Um, have which is okay. Okay, it's okay. You doing this blue buff? Where you at though? You doing my blue or something? Where are you at though? Oh, there you are. Not today. I have red buff though. You don't win this fight. Yeah, I have I have a full a full red buff. And I have my passive up because I was hitting the buff. You do not have your passive up because you are hitting nothing. That's just uh that's just a lost fight for you, my man. I need to keep make sure my uh oh i am hitting everything here i'm doing very good right now okay back he backed one minute in one kill in two buffs in let's go dude let's go and i missed try hard thursday it was uh it was always really fun to do and i don't know why i stopped doing it i just think i think the meme videos got more views than the try hard ones and eventually i just started every day just became <clears throat> excuse me every day just became meme monday because the meme monday videos were doing the best and i was like well if meme monday's videos are doing the best i bet you if every day was meme monday my channel would do the best <laughs> So that's basically what happened, but I missed the good old try hard Thursday, man. I'm glad to be back and I hope you guys are glad to see it again. I'm not exactly sure if you are, but I'm hoping. Didn't do any damage there, but. Ooh. Yeah, I hit for 16 more than him. Oh God. Oh, I knew that I was dead because he was following me. The only choice I had was to turn and fight that and like auto attack it. Um, and so I, I had to turn and I had to go for the autos. And the only thing that could redeem me was if he missed and I got the kill. Unfortunately, he felt like hitting his auto attacks just now, so... <clears throat> I have fallen. Olympus, if you will, has fallen. This bottle is going to burst. It's okay, because I have my finished ring of Hakate. I'm pumping hecka damage on this Taui. Taui's actually almost dead. He doesn't have his ring of Hakate yet. He does have his two up though, which will hurt. Um, I do have the red buff though. I can go grab real quick. Up a little warty boardy here. Make sure that he's not gonna try to do anything cheeky. Looks like he's he was going to. Hello. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Damn, look at my damage compared to his. He's hitting 63s, I'm hitting 100s. It's that stack during a Hecate plus the red buff doing 
so much work for me. Watch this. <clears throat> I really want to keep this blue buff pressure up. Looks like he is actually just going to back, huh? It's a little weird that he would let me have this for free. He will have his Ring of Hecate now, but I think as long as I get these first few autos on him, then it's all it's all mine to win. And I did get the first few. Can you keep up? Hmm. All right. Well, we did get Shell for Alt. That's 150 second cooldown for a 90 second cooldown. So it is okay. I just wish that we got the kill really bad there. Because if we got that kill, then I could maybe do Bull Demon or just straight up get the tower, which would open up Bull Demon for the future. But it's okay. He actually got a Chalice. I don't recommend buying Chalices when you're behind. Because it's so much gold. It's, it's you know, how many pots? Six pots worth of gold. <clears throat> but, I mean, I don't think it's horrible. I just, I just think if you're behind, getting Chalice is like almost too greedy a lot of the time oh that was a good damage i don't he autoed me but he didn't use his two he's gonna pop out the corner here with his two up though probably i assumed and now now he's not going to and now i look big dumb i'm very happy you hit me with that okay Powers down. No, hmm. Alright, use the minions. It was good. It was good on his. Good on his part. Doesn't matter much, honestly, because he has no mana and he has two minions. So even if he wanted to, the best he could do is about half of my tower's HP. I have a full shoguns now. He's probably only going to be able to afford tier two because he got that chalice. I am slowly taking sips of my uh my coffee. Um and I can go do Bull Demon. I do want to get the red buff first, obviously, but it's better to look out for ourselves. What's my next item gonna be? Probably a divine. Divine would be really nice against a uh, soul. Oh, he's actually doing it. Wow, that's really interesting. Huge immune. Oh my god. Yeah, that was a gigantic immune. I could maybe do Bull Demon with that minion wave, but it would be close. Because it looks like I only have one melee archer. Um, so I'm just not even going to risk it. I'm just going to get Bull Demon. And I've actually... I don't think he's gotten a single buff this game. I think I've had full buff control this entire game, which is pretty nuts. I would say that's pretty try-hard. Yeah, I do so much more damage than you. I have a full... I have a full defensive item that's also giving me more attack speed. And the red buff, obviously. I have to slowly work on this Phoenix, which is annoying, but... It'll be fine. Oh, he's just going to surrender. All right. One game down, nine minutes in. I'll see you guys in the second game. Welcome back, boys, to game number two. I'm going to pick the most try-hard god there is because, you know, why not? It's try-hard Thursday. It's an Izanami, and it's an Izanami mirror match. It's two mirror matches back-to-back. -back. Clearly, you're seeing duel at its finest. It's all, it's all meta picks, and it's most skilled player wins. Or, you know, who snowballs faster. Not necessarily skill involved. <laughs> There's skill involved in some occasion where if like, like, let's say I use my three, I juke him out and then I hit like four autos and he misses them. Like that's skill, right? That's skill. But if he just like gets the drop on me and then I die, even though we both hit everything, that's just matchup, dude. It's just, you know, we're the same character. If he hits me first and neither of us miss, 
you can't win. That's just how it works. Kind of like what just happened here. I hit him first. I didn't miss an auto, but... I think he dies. Yeah, he died. He died to mannequins. I thought he would die to it, but I wasn't sure. <laughs> I was super curious. It turns out he does die to mannequins. Let's go, dude. Let's go. That is a first blood. Both of our shells are down. That was, I mean, pretty much exactly what I said it would be, right? Like, I hit him first. We both have the same amount of stuff. We both missed literally a single auto attack. And because of that, I won the fight. Um, he is manigan, so I'm not gonna... Whoa, why are you here? Oh, I got one. Okay. He tried to fight me, but I am level 5. That was not the smartest play. Although, I will say, if I didn't have enough mana to ult, it would have been genius. But unfortunately for him, I did have enough mana to ult. So that is a second kill in under one minute. Let's go, dude. This is looking like a fiver. Pretty sure he has his blue buff. I doubt that he just didn't do the buff. That, doesn't, that wouldn't make any sense. I mean, he doesn't have it on him. <clears throat> I don't know if he had it on him during um, the last fight, if you want to call it really a fight. It was more so like he walked up and got ulted. He does have his ult up right now, but I think I'm comfortable fighting this because I have so much more HP than him. Yeah, okay. Run by me. Him. I want to fight him, dude. I really want to fight him here. Oh, that was actually huge damage. Wait, what? What is he doing? <laughs> Wait. Wait, what the heck is this? Is it, has he given up? Has he basically quit the game? I think he I think he pretty much has. I guess, you know, it's a mirror match. I'm three kills up, I'm a thousand gold up. What in reality is he going to do? I guess I can afford a chalice right now, huh? <clears throat> I don't know. I mean it's not like he quit the game. He's still pushing and clearing waves and stuff. He's still fighting me. He's not running into the tower, so maybe that was... Maybe that he just didn't see the minion wave. Or didn't see me behind him. There we go. Fourth kill in under three minutes. Oh, we are just absolutely shredding this guy. Do some Taui damage. I do want to get the red buff. Uh, he does have alt up, right? But I could actually die here, believe it or not. So I have a finish Hitchaval and he doesn't, so actually there's no way I lose this fight. Unless I missed everything, which I didn't. There's five kills at three minutes and 30 seconds. I'm, dude, I'm racking him up. I am racking him up. I see everything. Probably has Itchavol now, right? He's at 3,400 gold. He did finish Itchavol. I am down to fight, though. Always down to fight. All right. <clears throat> Six kills in under four minutes. This is... Oh, my God. <laughs> this is horrible. I'm just going to go mid-guard. <clears throat> we're going mid-guard. And we're farming. I do expect a five-minute surrender here. <clears throat> Excuse me. He does have his alt up. Blue is about to spawn. There's nothing up in the game. Perfect gameplay. He was just about to use his three. And what did I do? Ulted. 
Alted, silenced. Can't play the game. He got seven kills. About to hit the five minute mark. Will he surrender? Or will he play on? He will surrender at five. Perfect. I'll see you guys in the next game. Yo, what's up, boys? Game number three about to start. There, I could pick Soul here. Obviously, the best god in the roster at the moment that's not banned is Soul or some Hunter. Um, but you know, I already played Soul today for one of the videos in the I think the first game today. It was a Soul Mirror match. So this is the third game today. It's gonna be the first not Mirror match, and it's gonna be Baka versus Fenrir. I definitely think I win this matchup because if he threes, I should be able to ult. Um, that being said, that being said, until I get my ult, I'm pretty sure he dumpsters me. Unfortunately, I'm also not going to go beads, which could be dumb. I think the reason it could be dumb, obviously, if my reaction time is too slow when he ults and I don't ult and then he actually pulls me under tower and then I'm big fricked being big fricked is pretty not good um but the reason it's good is because if i do have that reaction time he alts and then i alt i just have straight up extra hp for the fight that's just all it is with the shell over the beads so i'm hoping that my reaction time doesn't fail me i did have coffee i don't know if it's hit my veins yet but you know maybe Always you when I want to try something new. I'm sorry. Um, what's some troll shit I can say? Call me daddy. <laughs> Please tell me it's a fun build. Nope. Try hard Thursday. <laughs> Please tell me it's a fun build. I, I can't lie to him, dude. I can't lie to him. I'm sorry. He just said, damn it. <laughs> He's upset. 50,000 on my head. That's disrespect. Unlucky, dude. This is mine. You can't stop me. Pretty sure you don't win this. Hey, red buff too. And that, my friends, is a first blood. He does have Boombas. Uh, tier 1 Boombas. Which recently got power added to it. Didn't have power before, and now it does have power. So it's actually pretty good. I think a lot of people are going Eye of the Jungle, though, right now to start the game. That is my buff, so I just want you to know that. Um, I am level 5 also, so I want you to know that as well. And that is a second kill in one minute. Second kill in one minute. You know, the last guy in the lobby um, that, I mean, you're not going to see, obviously, because I edit it, but uh, the last guy in the lobby, he said something that made me feel really happy. And he said, quote, damn, man, you're a beast when you're really trying to win. And I was like, oh, thanks. <laughs> so kind. So kind. I appreciate it, man. Because recently I've just been doing a bunch of troll shit and I think it's uh, it's been lost on people that I can be good at the game on occasion. So it was really nice that he said that. But I am going to go back real quick. I'm going to go Golden Blade just so I can clear. Nothing crazy. I mean, Fenrir can't really clear either. So having Golden Blade over a Fenrir is really going to put a lot of pressure on him. <clears throat> There's no farm on the map for him, so I think he's probably... He probably went over to check these, and then he's just going to back, to be honest. I got another two minutes before anything on the map spawns, so I'm just going to punch minions for now. And he is level 5. He does have his ult. I don't have mine, so be careful standing next to the tower line. Oh, no. No! Ah! Okay, I lived. Get him, minions! Beat his ass! <laughs> Beat his ass! Come on! No, they were so close. They were so close. Dang it. 
My reaction time did fail me. Seems as my coffee is uh not in the veins yet. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling. He has no ult, so I'm not scared. Um, he also has no transcendence yet. Once he gets that transcendence, it is gonna hurt. But until then. I don't know. I'm feeling really good. I got 800 HP. I definitely win the fights. Oh, he he was not expecting my damage, I guess. That was weird. I feel like he should have known that he wouldn't live through that, but... I don't know. Maybe just a Bakasura with only Golden Blade is a lot more damage output than you'd expect. And I mean, it is true. I've been caught off guard with it as well, because it does give you... 15% attack speed and 30 power. That 30 power is often overlooked. It doesn't seem like a lot until I'm punching you for 130. It doesn't seem like a lot until I five hit you with my auto attacks at level 10. So I could understand the confusion. But we are four minutes in, four kills in. Pretty much the entire theme of the day. Hold on, hold on. Uh, I gotta put the MMR thing up. I didn't do it for the last game, and I apologize about that. I forgot. Um, let's see what the MMR for this game is, though. It should pop up momentarily. Um, oh god, that's a yikes. He's at 1349 MMR. I'm at 2284. My MMR is really, really bad right now. Um, just because of the videos I've been uploading. <clears throat> I was thinking... Would it be hilarious... Or would it be dumb... To do... A series... Not even a series. Just like one long... One like hour and a half long video... Of a collage of... Bronze to Masters... With only Geb. <laughs> How long, how long would that take? I think Geb right now is like actually, actually good. And, and not ironically. I think he's actually good. So, I don't know. I was toying with the idea yesterday on stream and it felt like a fun idea. But I'm sure like, I'm sure when on like my fifth game on, my fifth game on, I'll fight like a, like an Izanami or something. Or like someone super try hard and immediately regret my decision to make the series. But it does sound fun, doesn't it? Like, come on. Punch him in the forehead. Jump on his head. Nice kills, nice kills. And that is a surrender. Six minutes in. Let's go on to game numero four. Watch row. Ah, ah, damn GG Gamer. GG. Okay, see you in game four. Welcome back. Game number five. I think game number five. Maybe game number four. I've played Soul. I've played Izanami. I've played Bakasura. So this is game number four. Um, Soul, Izanami, Bakasura. Let's play Kronos. Get up a Kronos. And uh, depending on how long this game is, game number five will be... Hopefully a different god. Maybe we can just pump out... Oh, we'll, we'll just do one video all 116 gods just every single god in the game. a to z series one try hard video god that video would be like like 70 hours long <laughs> holy shit imagine imagine opening your youtube and seeing a to z a to z in one video and it, you just look at the length and it's 70 hours 70 hours i think i get like four views on it Probably not even four. Probably, probably, probably two. It's my parents because they're confused about what I did for seventy hours. <laughs> that's that's probably what would happen. All right, so I, it's the same guy that I fought in the second game, I believe, which is good because that means that I can get his MMR again. Hopefully. So now you can know the MMR of everyone I fought this in today's video so far. 
Uh, he is 1643. I am 2284. Obviously, uh, the trend is that I am fighting people that should not be fighting, probably. And I'm getting plus zero every single game. That's just how it works. How I know my secrets is it's um, I wonder if he's going to come for this red buff. I don't think he should because he, he definitely does not win the level three fight. So I don't think he should come for the red buff. But if he does, have I have no problem stunning him and punching him in the forehead a little bit. Maybe like, maybe like two forehead punches. No, he's not. Oh, he is showing up. Oh, that is not good. Yeah, you definitely do not win these fights. All right. He did show up. That is first blood. And I'm, now I'm going to get red buff. I, I wonder, can I even do his blue maybe? Or is that like super troll to try to do his blue? No? He had to go for the wave, so actually it was safe. He's still level three and I, I literally have my ultimate up. That's so insane. I'm so far ahead right now. He doesn't have beads, so that stun hits and I just do so much damage. Oh, nice, nice shell, nice shell. Dude, he has like actually one HP left. <laughs> That's so insane. That shell saved him so hard. Holy crap. Nice. I muted myself so I could sneeze. Sorry. Anyways. Now that we have his blue, my red, and one of his lives. Let's go do my blue and get even further ahead. This is pretty much the theme of the day, man. Theme of the day. I'm playing OP gods. And uh and winning. That's that's try hard Thursday for you. He's sitting under tower. He he's a little bit scared. As he should be, to be fair. I'm Kronos and I'm ahead by a large margin. Let's see, how far am I at, actually? 700 gold? That's huge. Although, I will say, he can get Ichival. And that's a that's a big... By the way, I, I see the comments. I see the comments. It's not Ichival, it's Ichival. I don't care. <laughs> I'm just being honest. I don't care. It will forever be Ichival to me. And nothing you say will change that. I'm sorry. Either way, that's another kill. Two kills. We got his ult, we got his relic. He got my ult and my relic also, but I got the kill and he didn't. Let's go, dude. Um, I can back actually and get, I can back and get my Oringa Hakate. I wonder if, if, if I can fight him here actually. Oh, if I hit that one. You absolute boy. Wait, hold on. Still got it. Still got it. There it is. All right, that'll clear for me. Now we back after getting a third kill in three minutes. Go this and just get tier one of this. Why not? I don't see a reason why not to. More damage, more bragging, basically. We're now 1,300 gold ahead, rather than 700. Wait, okay, I was—I really thought he was going for that for that red buff, and I was like, oh, no, you do not. I'm not opposed to running directly at you. Clearly. Clearly. Two autos on the minis, and then just let mannequins do the work on the red. Thank you. And then we run at him. Never mind, he's running away, probably to do his blue. But I'm here anyways, what's up? How I know my Alright, we got his blue. We also got about half his HP. Ah! I got stuck in a trap. It's a trap. I'm on it. I hold the 
secrets of life. It's a trap. I'm dead. I'm on it. <laughs> okay. Get another kill here. Nice, nice. He definitely should have altered that, but it's all right. I hold the secrets of life and death. Dude, how much gold does he have? 3,800. He should definitely be able to afford the itch at all now. However, this is going to be a tower down. I'm not going to have a lot of uh, mana for this fight, actually. And he does have the itch of all. Maybe I don't win this fight. I got to be careful. Oh, he's just backing up. To be fair, though, you know, you're down four kills. You're down 2,000 gold. You probably don't want to risk it and just just be safe. <laughs> you know, even though I think he probably could have won that fight because I had not enough mana to use all my abilities and my ult. I had to pick between ulting or using abilities. Um, and he had the, the itch of ult to stack on me so my autos would be slower and stuff like that. So everything combined, I think that fight was actually in his favor, even though I was super far ahead of him. But sometimes it is better to be safe than sorry. Actually, no, I disagree. I disagree. Because he's so far behind right now that dying to me almost means nothing. You might as well go for the go for the glory play. Go for the kill. Because if you get it, you're back in the game, right? And if you die, oh no, I take Bull Demon. I just took that anyways. Doesn't matter. <laughs> so yeah, he definitely should have gone for that kill, actually. With a little bit more thought put behind it. So the big minion. And now fight this Phoenix. Oh. Okay. Ouch. It's a trap. I'm on it. Fight me. Oh. That was a good shell. I was not expecting that shell. I was not expecting that shell. However, that is a fifth kill and a phoenix down for me. Come on. There you go. Minions will spawn shortly. I'll clear all the minions very quickly. And then we fight. He's got nothing up. I missed, so it doesn't matter that he has nothing up. Ow, itch of all. Ow! Not today, Satan. Good kill. Kill, good kill. By the way, in that video where I was playing Thanatos, I, I it was yesterday's video. I titled it, I'm tryharding in this video. And I was reading through the comments. And there was people in the comments that said, quote, I'm tryharding in this video. Skips to 10 minutes dies to bull demon <laughs> look i told you in the video that bull demon is not supposed to punch you in the head seven times in a row it was bugged and if it if it worked the right way i wouldn't have died to it okay that it's the truth and you have to believe me because if you don't believe me then it makes me look worse <laughs> anyways that's another kill another kill i have no mana barely any hp so, you know, obviously my natural instinct is to walk into a trap under the Titan while I punch it in the head repeatedly. Oh God, he can kill me so easily, dude. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm seven and oh, we back here. We back here for sure. <laughs> we go telekines, we go blink. This might be the first game to make it past the 10 minute mark. I'm going to try my best to not let it. But we'll see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna blink on him and like go full aggro mode, trying to end this game before the 10 minute mark. I have exactly 57 seconds to do so. Maybe I just blink past him. I, can I kill him and the Titan within 50 seconds? Maybe. Actually, maybe. Hold on. Come on, win before 10, baby. Let's go. That's eight kills and a nine minute and 26 second finish. No game 
past the 10 minute mark yet and that was game number four i will see you guys in game number five thank you for sticking with me this long it's gonna be about twice as long from this point forward so i'll see you there welcome back boys to game number what game is this five six six or five five or six um let's run it back right we got izanami soul bakasur chronos and now we have hades this is number five i'm fighting a freya which does scare the crap out of me because if this gets even remotely late game i think i lose by default so here's the game plan don't lose don't even die and if you do then say you lag so nobody makes fun of you and then get a comeback kill so you get extra gold that's that's the game plan here i definitely don't win the level three fight um so my plan is <clears throat> i ward the blue but i stand at the red right he pulls red because i'm not gonna pull it it's especially because I don't even have mannequins or Boombas. I will go Boombas Hammer late game, but I need to be level 20 for that. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I want you to do blue. I don't want you to do red. If you do red, I'm sad. If you do blue, I'm happy because I just want to steal the buff from you. All right. I'm happy right now. I am happy right now. I autoed him so that the fear does work. Immensely happy, immensely happy. Alright. We got his blue buff. And we are clearing the wave. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Exactly what I wanted to happen. We fear him when he uses his, uh, his two so that he, um waste time on it and can't clear the wave that's basically what you should always do if you have a cc you use it when freya's just activated her too that's just what you should always do not even what you should do as hades but what you should do always should be able to explode this red buff at about 350 hp so we auto it down until it's about 400 and we detonate and auto um, I do have my alt. He does have beads, but like you might as well get those beads, right? Mm. I can't I can't dive him can I it would be dumb to dive Oh, he started hitting me instead of the wave which is actually really good for me because It's less gold on him that he gets because he doesn't get the full uh the full damage off on the minion because you only get gold for minions if the tower never hits them in duel in duel if you um in conquest you still get one gold i believe if the tower hits them and maybe two if you last hit it i think something like that it's weird i don't know why it's different between duel and conquest but it is actually i do know why it's different it's because dual minions are actually stronger than conquest minions. I don't know why, because in reality, it doesn't make any sense. You would assume that, you know, in conquest, there's more people. So the minions would be stronger. And in duel, there's only one person per team. So the minions would be weaker. But actually, it's completely different. The archers hit harder and um, have more HP. In duel than they do in conquest not that that matters much i suppose all right i want to get his beads here so we fear and then we alt either his alt or his beads but he, we did get his beads which is what i wanted perfect i just want to kind of um sit here and just annoy him like make sure that he's not last hitting minions and so i'm getting my lead further and further ahead because I mean, obviously it's Freya, right? I just, I just don't want Freya to get to late game. Anything I can do to stop Freya from hitting late game, I'm gonna do it. This blue buff is spawning. Don't mind if you ward it, because I'm pretty sure there's no way you steal it. I have Bancrofts now, so my DPS is crazy good on buffs, or just on waves, or like really anything. 
Hello, Freya. You don't mind? I'm gonna sit here. I'm going to kill you if you don't back. Or I'm gonna get your alt for completely free. And there's your alt. I run out and then I run back in. Get a nice fear, a nice detonate, and that is a first blood baby. Oh, actually, hold on. Forgot. Let's pump the MMR thing up real quick. Um, my guess is 1650. 1650 MMR is my guess. Let's see what it is. It is 1550. I was 100 MMR off. But 1550 MMR, that's fine. I'll take that uh, down once I get this red buff. I just want to make sure that I get it. Nice, nice, nice. Now we take that back off. Um, he is playing the god well, though. Like, he's just camping, which is basically what you have to do as Freya. He has no ult and he has no beads, so this ult straight up is 100 to zeroes him, I think. Yeah, that was a bad play to, to get aggressive there from him. He, he got 100 to zeroed by the ult and just paused. <laughs> he's just straight up paused right now. Oh no. Oh no, dude. What's happening? Hey, baby. What's up? What's up, buddy boy? Papa's crying next to me for some reason. He's already pooped twice today. It's only like 9 a.m. or 10 a.m. or something. What time is it? Babe? There's your headphones on. 8.30. I play this game to escape getting beat by my dad. Looks like I found a new pop. <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh no! I feel so bad. Looks like I found a new poppy. <laughs> Oh god. That's hilarious. What the heck, dude? <laughs> That's so funny. Um Alright, let's just keep playing. What should my next item be? Polly would be nice. Oh. Up is growling. Oh, he's playing. He's playing. He's playing. Um, power. Let's just go poly, like, immediately. I know I don't have a lot of anti-heal right now, but poly's going to help me pressure the Phoenix, which is going to be really ideal for ending this game early. <laughs> and I should get a blink. It's going to be tough for me to uh, get the bull demon, but... I should be able to. My my uh, secure is much better than a Freya's. Assuming I don't mess it up. Which, you know, happens a lot. Ooh, do you actually get that? Oh, so close. Alright, we'll get his beads now. Actually, we got his ult. I have Polly, so you don't scare me. Um. Alright. I can't actually get the Phoenix here, I don't think. Unfortunately. Um, I am gonna just fight him a bunch, though. Like... I think that the only way I get anything successful here is by by fighting him. I know obviously he has Bancrofts and he wants to win the game, but all right, we got minions in, and now my Polly's actually hitting hard, which is fantastic. So I can actually get the Phoenix here. The, re the reason I didn't think I could is because I thought he was just going to be full aggro because he has. He has uh, Bancroft's and defense, so he was just gonna tank through me and um, and lifesteal off the minions because I have no anti-heal yet. 
but he played a little bit too scared in my opinion and i was able to get the phoenix off of it which is really cool and this game definitely will last longer than 10 minutes i don't think i'm going to be able to end he's playing really defensive i only have a minute and a half to end the game so i don't think that's going to happen Uh, he does have beads, so he will bead this. Just gonna hold it though, because obviously. Um, and then we're just gonna, I don't know, do as much damage to objectives and stuff as we can. To the Titan. I'm tanking it, but there's fire minions hitting it. I mean, it's not, it's not a trivial, a trivial quest for this Freya right now. Oh, we fear and then we dash away. Should be 100% safe. In fact, I'm almost certain we could still win that fight, to be honest, but there's no reason to risk it. Um, I'm going to get thorns here because my game plan is just because he has no beads right now. He has to alt. So I'm just going to. Why is he crying? So I'm just going to jump in there. I'm going to fear him and pop thorns and alt. So Titan and him will both be hitting me. And I'll be A-OK -okay to uh, just keep pumping the damage out output on him. Obviously, I want to look really aggressive here because he just popped his two. And um, if he can't use his two, well, then he can't clear, right? So some tower damage here. I am okay right now. And now we have this. Thorns popped with alt. And there you go. A 10 minute and 12 second game. The first game that went over 10 minutes. And that was game number 5 or 6. I'm not really sure. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next game. What's up, sexy Samulander squad? This will probably be the last game of the video. And we're playing Hoi. You're 5. <laughs> she, she looked over and said quote what is this a marvel movie <laughs> this is a good quote man this is a good quote all right let's see what the suki yobi's mmr is pump it up pump it up i'm guessing based on the name what the heck 2100 minimum minimum it's 1750 okay <laughs> so we played Recap. Oleron. We didn't play Oleron. I lied. Soul. Hades. Kronos. Akasura. Oyi. Izanami. That's six. That's six games. Dude, that's a, that's a lot of games, dude. That's so many. That's so many games. <laughs> but he is right there. Two autos to clean up the minis. Alright, I got red buff. I got the red buff. And I did have to pop my pots, but I am looking pretty healthy right now. I don't think... Uh, I don't think one point everything is the way to start Tsukiyomi. I'm pretty sure you just go two points into one. But I'm looking really happy right now. Cause he's not he's not pumping out a lot of damage. And I have red buff. Pushing waves. I got his blue buff right now. And he definitely cannot stop it. Dude, this is a great start to this game. No uh no first blood yet. But there's time. There is time. Let's see. He's got beads as his relic choice. I assume he backed. Um, He's still level 4. So I'm not in danger of any kind of rogue alts. 
Go ahead, jump through my blue. And that is blue buff down. And we're chilling, man. We got every single farm aspect on this map. Every single thing. We got all three buffs and the XP camp. We're 400 gold ahead of him. Um, he does have his ult, but I can Aegis it, so no big deal. And in fact, I want to make sure that he hits me once with his ult to TP to me. And then I want to Aegis so that I can... Um, so I can ult my feet. And he teleports to me and just gets completely crapped on by his own ult. I wonder if I can ult him here, actually. Very nice. Very nice. I went really aggro because I expected he would try to kill me there. And I was right. And because of that... If I was right, he actually ended up dying. Because I knew if he ulted me, I was just going to let him hit me again, like I said. Let him hit me a little bit, and then I'll Aegis so he teleports to me. He hit me with the four beams, I guess, and then I Aegis the actual damage of it. And I'm in a good spot. You don't scare me literally at all. I have a full itch of all. Nothing you do will scare me right now. That's a kill. All right, two kills, three minutes in. And this is going to give me the red buff. Stay alert, Flutter Fiend. I do wonder if he's going to quit, actually. He might, he might quit because he did just stand there while I was killing him. Yo, my damage output is so good. Holy crap. With the itch of all... I hit those stuns, I hit those autos. He just gets completely shredded. And to this moment in the game, he's got no farm. Even some of the waves he's missed. Nice beats. Nice beats. I think he probably does want to fight. He probably does want to ult me. Um. All right. I was okay with him ulting me because I was pretty sure it wasn't going to kill me. And originally, originally I was just going to jump over the wall to the blue buff. But, um, I saw how little damage it did, and I knew that I could actually go for the kill rather than just going for the survive. Going for the red, or going, jumping over the wall to the blue buff would have given me some farm and would have let me live for sure. But, um, getting that kill there is just, I mean, it's just infinitely better. I am going to go Oboe. I don't really like this build anymore. Uh, Age of all into Oboe because Oboe got nerfed. But, you know, is what it is. Um, we're five minutes into the game. He just finished his transcendence. Oh, yeah. Okay. He's running that tower, dude. He's running that tower. He's probably going to surrender. Yeah, there's that. All right. That's the video, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed the Try Hard Thursday. Only one game went over 10 minutes, and it was only 12 seconds over 10 minutes. So, pretty good. Uh, pretty good show of skill i think hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to like comment and subscribe and until next time guys hey